in South Africa and globally at this time of the year, beginning 25th of November, right through the 10th of December, we mark the 16 days of activism. 16 days of activism on no violence against women and girls. This year's 16 days of activism takes place amidst the global pandemic, the COVID-19 pandemic, which we know is likely to have devastating impact on the lives and future of adolescent girls and young women. In South Africa, like elsewhere, the lockdown, the disruptions, and the uncertainties associated with the pandemic have placed adolescent girls and women at heightened risk of sexual violence, child marriage, unintended pregnancies, and disproportionate care work. In 2019, in response to the prevailing gender-based violence, UNICEF, UNFPA, Global Affairs Canada joined forces with the government in the establishment of a joint program on empowering women and girls to realize their sexual and reproductive health and rights in South Africa. A program which is grounded on the understanding that services alone will not work and that it is important that we work to decrease the discriminatory and harmful practices and attitudes that perpetuate and validate sexual and gender-based violence in women and girls, while also strengthening data collection and analysis across sectors. The joint program kicked off shortly before the COVID-19 pandemic, and it seeks to increase the access of quality sexual and reproductive health and SGBV services for the most vulnerable adolescent girls and young women. We do this in selected districts of the provinces of Eastern Cape and KwaZulu-Natal, where we have the worst performing human development indicators, including high rates of reported SGBV, teenage pregnancy, and HIV burden among adolescent girls. All evidence suggests that healthy, educated girls will, in the course of their lives, contribute to the greater economic growth, higher agricultural productivity, lower rates of infant and maternal mortality, smaller and better educated families, lower prevalence of HIV and malaria, and more women in leadership positions. Let's celebrate the 16 days of giving women and girls their most basic needs, bodily autonomy and the right to be free from violence.